Are you or someone you know in need of financial assistance due to a disability, blindness, or old age? Supplemental Security Income, or SSI, might be the solution you're looking for. In this video, we'll dive deep into what SSI is, who qualifies, and how it can provide crucial support for those in need. First off, what exactly is Supplemental Security Income? SSI is a program administered by the Social Security Administration, aimed at providing financial assistance to individuals with limited income and resources who are either aged, 65 or older, blind, or disabled. Unlike Social Security Disability Insurance, SSDI, which is based on work history and contributions to Social Security, SSI is a needs-based program funded by general tax revenues. To qualify for SSI, you must meet certain eligibility criteria. This includes having limited income and resources, being a U.S. citizen or national, or in certain categories, being legally present in the United States. Additionally, you must meet the age requirement, be blind or disabled, and not be confined to an institution like a nursing home or prison. Now, let's talk about income and resource limits. The federal benefit rate for SSI is $794 per month for individuals and $1,191 per month for couples. However, this amount can vary depending on your state of residence and other factors. In addition to the federal benefit rate, states may supplement SSI payments. These supplements can vary greatly from state to state, with some providing more generous benefits than others. It's essential to check with your state's Social Security office to understand the specific amounts and eligibility criteria. Now, let's break down how SSI payments are calculated. The Social Security Administration considers both countable income and resources when determining your SSI benefit amount. Countable income includes wages, Social Security benefits, pensions, and other forms of income. Resources refer to assets such as cash, bank accounts, stocks, and real estate. If your countable income is less than the federal benefit rate, you may be eligible for the full SSI benefit amount. However, if you have income exceeding the federal benefit rate, your SSI payment will be reduced accordingly. It's important to note that not all income and resources are counted, and certain exclusions apply. Now, let's talk about some important considerations regarding SSI. First, it's crucial to report any changes in your income, resources, or living situation to the Social Security Administration promptly. Failure to do so could result in an overpayment or underpayment of benefits. Second, if you receive SSI benefits, you may also be eligible for other forms of assistance, such as Medicaid, SNAP, Supplemental Nutrition Assistance Program, and Housing Assistance. These programs can provide additional support to help meet your basic needs. 